Meet Dorothy Van Nest. Dorothy is an educator, mother, grandmother, wife, cancer survivor, and grant programs manager at East Central Ohio Educational Service Center. Dorothy was nominated by not one, but multiple people who have worked with her throughout her many years of service. She takes on more and more responsibilities when everybody else when they retire, take on less and less. That's not Dorothy, that's not how she works. She has the biggest heart of anyone um, that I know, and she is totally devoted to um, helping students and children in our area to experience things that they may not um, usually have a chance to experience. She just is just a, a great blessing. She's a great person. We really appreciate her. Dorothy worked as a preschool teacher for 25 years in St. Clairsville. After retirement, she decided to take another job at the East Central Ohio Education Service Center in order to continue her impact in the community. To Dorothy, her work comes naturally to her, but to others, what she does is extraordinary. One example takes us to earlier this year when she wanted to give the kids and families in her program a fun night on the town. She reached out to our community for um, the students with of her after school program to get the funding to take them to the Harlem Globetrotters. And we just want to do something fun with them for an evening, something that they might not get to take advantage of ever in their lifetime. She just put, um, put a post out on her um, personal Facebook page asking anybody that would be interested in donating um, anything monetary like monetary or um, just any local businesses that would be interested in sponsoring it and I mean she had just an outpouring. In order to take the trip the organization needed around $2,700 but after Dorothy's post they were able to raise over $5,400. Raised money to not only take them there but they each got snacks, they got dinner, they got t-shirts, they got programs. It was amazing and she did it all in about 48 hours. So everybody knows and loves Dorothy Venice. What was supposed to be a simple evening turned into a once in a lifetime family affair thanks to Dorothy. If you're in teaching, you do it for a reason. And it's not the money, for sure. <laughs> it's, ju it, it, it's just to see these kids succeed and give every one of them a chance and a place where they belong. Dorothy gives all of the credit to her team. She walked us through where each person sits and their role in helping her succeed. She says it's their faces that keep her working. It's my staff who teaches during the daytime at these schools for seven and a half hours, and then they come and do after school for three more hours. And her team has been there for her in more ways than one. In 2009, Dorothy was diagnosed with stage three breast cancer. In 2014, she had a double mastectomy and now is able to say that she is cancer-free. But even through treatment, Dorothy worked. Not once did her mindset say that she was going to give in to this. Um, she had too much to do in life, and she did it. She came to work um, right after her surgery. She was, she was not supposed to even be up and about and moving with drains and everything. And she came to work. So when Dorothy is not inspiring others, cheering on a former student, or helping get funding for kids in the Ohio Valley, she's a grandma. I just wish her always the best of everything because she's helped me so much. She's helped so many people and that's just who she is. Congratulations to Dorothy Van Nest for being a shining light in so many lives. Your hard work and dedication are appreciated and now recognized as you are truly an Addison's achiever. If you'd like to nominate someone, head to our website, WTOV9.com. For now, I'm Addison Elbert with News 9's Addison's Achievers.